Hello, 360. Shalom. Good morning, Ephrata. My name is Seth. And I'm Jonah. And today is Tuesday, February 6th. Jonah, why, why are you wearing so many glasses? Please rise for a moment of silence and reflect your flag. I cannot see at all. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to read the date, but then I forgot what it was and I couldn't see it. So. Oh, Is that when you set my glasses? Yeah. I can't even see when it's about to come. I got you. Hello, 360. There will be a meeting of Tri-M Music Honor Society on Wednesday morning at 7.15 in the auditorium. Ah, there we go. Up for an adventure? Willing to try something you never had before? Go on a blind date with a book this February. This, the entire month, there will be books covered, some with topics, genres, and minimal inf information on the outside available to check out. For every blind date you check out, you will be entered to win a free drink at the Media Center. Fall in love with a good book. Attention all students taking AP classes. AP exam signups begin today. Pick up an order form from the AP bulletin in your AP class or stop down to the co uh, counseling office to pick one up. Order forms and exam deposits are due in, in the counseling office by Friday, March 16th. Attention juniors! Millersville University will be hosting a college fair on Thursday, March 15th. This fair attracts approximately 150 different colleges, universities, and trade school representatives. <coughs> this is a great opportunity for 11th graders to interact with and learn about different colleges. The itinerary includes attending the college fair, having lunch in the Millersville Dining Hall, and taking a campus tour. If you are interested in attending, please print out a, permit, a field trip permission packet from Schoology. Space is limited, so don't delay. Now over to Gerald with the news. Who's the lunch? Uh, Ethan and Derek. In Lord Hagen the Fourth news, Jerome Powell was sworn in as the new chairperson of the Federal Reserve yesterday, Monday, February 5th. He replaced the previous chairperson, Janet Yellen, an Obama era appointee, but is likely to take many of the same monetary policy decisions as the chairperson of the Federal Reserve has historically been a nonpartisan position. He has also been the most wealthy member of the Federal Reserve Board of Governors with a net worth of approximately $112 million. Today, in 1937, John Steinbeck's classic novella, Of Mice and Men, was published. The story about two migrant workers looking for jobs was also a critique on some of the social norms of the time. This was the first of Steinbeck's novels to actually be a commercial success. This is an especially important novel to read today to help understand what times were like back in the Great Depression. Also, this one goes out to Channel Eby. Today is Ronald Reagan's birthday! Happy birthday! This actor turned president was a pivotal in the switch of the country took in this political spectrum in the 1980s. Happy birthday, Ronnie. Now, over to some guys with lunch. Ethan <laughs> Derrick. Did you like the one I picked? Yeah. Maybe I would give my Sports resorts, none. Today, in sports, boys basketball is away at Mannheim Central. Girls basketball is home versus Mannheim Central. And Rockwell Hood is kind of sick of Valley. Now back to the main dad. So.
starting today, tickets for the Sadie's Valentine stands go on sale. Ask your Valentine now. No worries if you don't have a Valentine. Groups of friends can go and dance the night away. Don't like to dance? There will be other activities for everyone in the hallways. Around the gym. Ticket sales will be in the cafeteria February 6th, 7th, 8th, and 9th during all lunches. $7 in advance and $10 at the door on this Saturday night. All profits go to our Mini Thumb Club and Benefits for Diamonds, the organization which funds research for childhood cancer. Ooh. Mini Thon registrations are now available. Mini Thon, a fun event for students, will be held March 3rd in the middle school gymnasiums. Games, food, DJ, raffle items, what more could you want? Check the Schoology message that was sent out Friday to all students. Questions? Message Mr. Martin or Mrs. Sosie. Juniors, you guys are in need of a few good people to help out this year's prom together. If you like to decorate, we have a job for you. If you are good with the desktop publishing and document design, we have a good job for you. If you don't know music and you know what your peers like to dance to, well, we really have a good job for you. All meetings will be held on Wednesday afternoons at 2.40 in room 209. But due to scheduling conflict this week, our meeting will be held on Thursday at 2.40 in room 109. Hope to see you there. Now over to the crew live at the first marking period pep rally. This is amazing. Is it coming back to us or is it just going to end then? I'm just going to go to credits. Sea bombs C -bombs. And, and Mr. <clears throat> Shady. Slim Shady and Sea bombs. <laughs> I wish I knew what they were saying. <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> oh, why? Yeah. <laughs> exact Air Force Ones and these pants in the boys' bathroom. And I was just like, okay, you're going to crap. And I see this that much, I'm like, no. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Wait, who was the girl? Remember that chick with like, like, like I swear she 